him on Wednesday in the wake of his controversial remarks about the weekend violence in Charlottesville, the Strategic and Policy Forum and the White House Manufacturing Jobs Initiative were both dissolved as corporate leaders continued to resign. Trump claimed in a tweet that this was his decision, writing, rather than putting pressure on the business people of the Manufacturing Council. Down his advisory panels is just beginning, Nils Prattley read more the collapse of the advisory. Bodies follows seven different corporate leaders stepping down from the two councils in recent days, including the CEOs of both Campbell's Soup and 3M on Wednesday. Trump had previously stated that resignations from both panels were of no consequence. For every CEO that drops out of the Manufacturing Council, I have many to take their place. Grandstanders should not have gone on jobs, he said on Twitter on Tuesday. Wednesday's abrupt decision came after Trump confidant Stephen Schwartzman, chief executive of the Blackstone Group, held a conference call for about a dozen members of the Strategic and Policy Forum who decided to abandon it, the New York Times reported. Executives from the Manufacturing Council had been due to hold a similar call that afternoon, the paper added. On Wednesday, corporate leaders who sat on the council's race to denounce Trump's comments about Charlottesville and to support the dissolution of the advisory bodies. Jamie Dimon, the CEO of J.P. Morgan and a member of Strategic and Policy Forum, said in a statement, I strongly disagree with President Trump's reaction to the events that took place in Charlottesville over the past several days. He added that he agreed with the council's decision to disband Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest the most contentious moments from Trump's latest press conference video Jeffrey Immelt, the CEO of General Electric, who had previously said on Monday that he would not step down from the Manufacturing Advisory Board, put out a statement on Wednesday afternoon announcing that he had resigned. Three members of the Manufacturing Council resigned on Monday after Trump's initial refusal to condemn the neo-Nazi and white supremacist protesters in Charlottesville by name.